guys, and welcome back to Tom Hobby. Sorry about the lighting, but wow, that's very bright. Um, but yeah, anyway, today I'm completely painting my whole PC setup, so I'll just show you. As, oh, it's a bit heavy, so as you can see, it is a white and red colour scheme. I'm going to change it to white, uh, white and pink, so I'm going to paint the graphics card, paint the RAM, paint the front panel of the PC. But yeah, let's get into it. It's a heavy boy. Okay, I've taken all the parts out of the PC, as you can see, so I just need to take apart the RAM, take apart the graphics card and the front panel. I have to unscrew the glass, tempered glass up because I don't want to accidentally paint that. But first I need to go get a hairdryer, so I have to go borrow one from my cousin, which is about a five minute walk away from my house. But I should put on my mask so I don't catch coronavirus. So I've got the hairdryer. It's time to start taking stuff apart. I'll do the RAM last though because the silicone pads and that, um, I need to make sure I'm, I've not got them unstuck for too long because I don't want them to dry up pretty much. So yeah, I'll do the RAM last, but time to take apart the graphics card and the front panel. So with the graphics card, I seem to have frayed some of the screws. I personally believe that's because the last time I painted it, I must have put the screws on too quickly and it's got stuck to the paint. So the screws and the paint got stuck to each other, which means the screws aren't coming out of the GPU, which is fine because I'll just paint the rest of the PC red. I'll stop the pink color scheme, just paint that one round thick red I need to paint and paint the front panel red as well. It's a bit of a bummer, but shit happens. So yeah, front panel red time. So I have removed the tempered glass from the front panel. There it is. I'm going to keep that strip on the end of it white because I think it'd be quite good for the aesthetics. So I'm just going to paint this bit. That's red. Oh, sorry about the camera work. My actual tripod broke, so I'm having to use a rubbish one. And I'm going to paint that red as well, which should be pretty fun. So now it's just time to take apart the RAM. So I have removed the six of RAM, or the heat sinks of the RAM. This time I didn't break it, but it's very hot. It burnt my hand a couple of times, but look at that, not broken at all. So anyway, let's paint this quickly because I need to get the uh, soldering back onto it. It's time to do some painting.
So that's all painted. Now I just need to let it dry for a couple of hours. Let's come back out in a bit. So I installed the RAM into the computer, put it all back together. So that's looking sexy. It all appears in the system. So we've got the red and white RAM. I prefer this red over base course here once because it fits my GPU and now the front of my case. But time to put this back together on the front panel with the tempered glass. Okay, so I've painted and put back together the front panel, which I think looks awesome. So it's time to put all the PC back together now. So the front panel's done. GPU I didn't do because it was already red. I was going to paint it all pink, but um, as I said, the screws in the GPU are messed up, so they won't actually come out. So I need to, yeah, can't really do anything with that. And that's done. So I just need to um, set the backlight to red and then see how it goes. Let's see what it looks like on the piece. Oh, okay, that looks awesome. Let's push it in on all sides. So that's it with the red front panel. Okay, I think that looks proper cool. I was thinking I might do the top panel along here as well. But um, yeah, I, I do like the red and white. So I might leave this all white, just do this top panel red eventually. This side panel I'll keep white, I think. Yeah, I think that looks awesome. Time to put the rest of it back in though, like the GPU. Okay, uh, I've said this before, and I'll say it again. Of course they have a really bad mounting system for the GPU, but let's put it back on anyway. Okay, so it's time to um, put the glass panel back on. All the k one is done, GPU back in. My room's messy as fuck, sorry about that. Here we go. Oh, and then screws. I should probably paint these white or red. Look quite fit the aesthetic a bit. There we go. I should probably paint the um, uh, H, also H60 red as well. Yeah, I was thinking about doing the back plate in there. So, like, you can see the black, the motherboard tray, I guess you'd call it. The bit the motherboard sits on. I was thinking about making that red as well, but. I'm not too sure yet. I need to buy some more spray paint. And I have to go all the way to Brighton for that, which is like 20 miles away. Or at least to the shop I like anyway. I can get online, but there's a particular shop I like. Anyway, let's plug it in and see if it all still works. Hopefully it does. Okay, I'm just going to test out the on before I plug it from Kelsen, but here we go. Oh, that looks so sexy. Look at that. Oh my god. That is fabulous. Okay, I've plugged all the cables back in. Let's see if it boots to the monitor. If it gets turned on, it actually looks fabulous. Hopefully we'll get display here. So it might have a bit of an issue because when I took it apart, it only had, um, what you call it? Uh, 24 gigs of RAM, it's got 32 now, so it might not like that. Let's just see. So it's not booting yet, so that could be an issue. Come on, boot, you know you want to. Uh, what does that say, VGA? What's wrong with the VGA? That means the graphics card, by the way. Oh yeah, okay, so it wants me to run this up. So, uh, advanced. Uh, DRAM frequency. Uh, it's not the D DDR4 3000, yep. Save and exit. Okay, so 32 gigs of RAM in there now. I think you should like it. But yeah, that was like guaranteed to happen because I changed the amount of RAM. But just to look at it, that is just such a sexy looking computer now. Definitely need to add red up here, I think. 
Okay, I've reseated the RAM. It's all back in now. Hopefully it actually works this time, but it's all been reseated. I don't know. Hopefully it works. Let's go. Just hope. Pray for Jeebus. It should all just go. Yeah. There we go. Task Manager. Performance. Sick. Okay, it's only saying I've got 16 gig. I don't know why. Uh, it's all plugged in correctly and everything. Yeah, the light's popping up for the RAM, so it's saying there's something wrong with it. I don't know that. Just see what stick it is, I guess. Yeah, it seems to only think I have 16 gigs of RAM. Oh, 16 gig. There, see it saying physical memory, 16 megabytes. Not sure why. Advanced. Yeah, I gotta have a look into this. Okay, so the RAM's all working now. I just have to reseat it quite a few times actually. I've had to reseat it like six times. But yeah, PC's done. Um. Thank you guys for watching this video. I was just painting my PC and the RAM. I was going to paint the video card and I was going to paint it pink, but that didn't happen. Thank you guys for watching anyway. Um, wish everybody luck with the whole coronavirus. Don't die. I'm probably going to demonetize for using that word now, but I don't get monetized anyway, so it's fine. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.